Hello everyone. Today we are going to do a problem based on compass surveying. Let us read the question. The following bearings were taken in running a closed traverse. Lines are given. Four bearings are given and back bearings are given. At what stations do you suspect local attraction? Determine the correct magnetic bearings. If declination was 5 degree 10 minutes east, what are the true bearings? First, let us see where there can be local attraction. We know that the difference between fore bearing and back bearing should be 180 degree. We can easily check the minutes of fore bearing and back bearing and find if there is a local attraction. Let us take the line AB. You can see that both of these two minutes are different. So the difference will not be equal to 180 degree. Let us take the line BC. You can see that there is a difference in the minutes. So the difference will not be equal to 180 degree. Now let us take the line CD. You can see that both of these two minutes are same. So there is a possibility the difference can be 180 degree, 345 degree, 35 minutes minus 165 degree, 35 minutes. We will get exactly 180 degree. Since the difference of these two is 190 degree, the stations C and D are free from local attraction. Let us take the line DE. You can see the minutes both are different. So the difference will not be equal to 180 degree. Finally, let us take EA. Here also you can see that both of the minutes are different. So the difference of back bearing and fore bearing will not be equal to 180 degree. In this case, only the stations C and D are free from local attraction. We can suspect that the stations A, B and E are affected by local attraction. Now let us make a table. In the table, first let us enter the line. Then let us enter the bearings. For bearing of line AB is 75 degree 5 minutes. Back bearing is just the reverse. So for the line AB, the back bearing is BA. For BA, we have 254 degree 20 minutes. For line BC, the fore bearing is 115 degree 20 minutes. Back bearing of BC is CB and it is 296 degree 35 minutes. The fore bearing of CD is 165 degree 35 minutes. The back bearing of CD is DC and it is 345 degree 35 minutes. Fore bearing of DE is 224 degree 50 minutes. And its back bearing is ED, which is 45 degree 5 minutes. Fore bearing of EA is 304 degree 50 minutes. Back bearing of EA is AE, which is 125 degree 5 minutes. These two readings are taken in the station A. These two readings are taken in the station B. These two readings are taken in the station C. These two readings are taken in the station D and finally these two readings are taken in the station E. We know that the stations C and D are free from local attraction. Also we know that these two readings are taken in the station C. So both of these readings should be correct. And these two readings are taken from the station D. So both of these two readings also should be correct. Now let us make two more columns. In the first additional column, we can enter the correction. In the second additional column, we can write the corrected bearings. We know that these four readings are correct. In this case, there is no correction required. So we can enter these four directly into corrected bearing. If we know the correct back bearing, we can easily find the four bearing. The formula is back bearing plus or minus 190. If back bearing is less than 190, we have to use the positive sign. If the back bearing is more than 190, we
we have to use the negative sign. We know that CB is the back bearing of BC. For CB, we know the correct bearing 296 degree 35 minutes. Using that, we can find the correct four bearing. Since this is more than 180, we have to use the negative sign 296 degree 35 minutes minus 180 degree. We will get 116 degree 35 minutes. Now let us find how much correction we have applied. 116 degree 35 minutes minus 115 degree 20 minutes. We will get positive 1 degree 15 minutes. We know that both of these two readings are taken from the station B. So for BA also the same correction should be applied. To get the corrected bearing, we have to add these two. When we add, we will get 255 degree 35 minutes. We know that BA is the back bearing of AB. We have the correct bearing for BA. Using that, we can find the four bearing AB. Since it is more than 180 degree, we have to use the negative sign. 255 degree 35 minutes minus 190 degree we will get 75 degree 35 minutes now let us find the correction 75 degree 35 minutes minus 75 degree 5 minutes we will get positive 30 minutes we know that both of these two readings are taken from the station A so the same correction should be applied here you can see that I have applied the same correction. To find the corrected bearing of AE, we have to add these two. After adding, we will get 125 degree 35 minutes. We know that AE is the back bearing of EA. We know the corrected bearing for AE. Using that, we can find the four bearing EA. Since this is less than 180, we have to use the positive sign 125 degree 35 minutes plus 180 degree. We will get 305 degree 35 minutes. Now let us find the correction 305 degree 35 minutes minus 304 degree 50 minutes. We will get positive 45 minutes. We know that both of these two readings are taken from the station E. So for ED also, the same correction should be applied. To find the corrected bearing of ED, we have to add these two values. When we add, we will get 44 degree 50 minutes. Now we can verify our answers. We know that ED is the back bearing of DE. To find the bearing for DE, we can use this corrected reading. Since it is less than 180, we have to use the positive sign. 44 degree 50 minutes plus 190 degree. We will get 224 degree 50 minutes. We already know the bearing for DE. That is 224 degree 50 minutes. We have got the same value. So our answers are correct. Except these four readings. We have applied corrections to other readings. So we can be sure that stations C and D are only free from local attraction and stations A, B and E are affected by local attraction. The declination is given as 5 degree 10 minutes east. Since the direction is east, to find the true bearings, with these bearings we have to add 5 degree 10 minutes. After adding, we are getting the true bearings. Now we are going to end this session. Thank you for watching this video.